Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to this edition of Awareness Elevation. I'm your host, James Pyle, and today I wanted to speak a little bit about uh, the topic matter of morning routines. The things that we do when we get out of bed in the morning to be able to activate the proper mind state and get us geared up and engaged for the day. So one of the things that I like to begin my day with first and foremost is of course some oil pulling, a tongue scrape and an oil pull. And then I usually throw on the tea kettle with some hot water while I stand on a whole body vibration machine. And through standing on the whole body vibration machine, it helps to wake my body up and wake my mind up. I do some different stretches and some different exercises. And after that, I usually move straight into making a cup of coffee because it's always good to get some caffeine in the system. Uh, if you enjoy caffeine, which I do, a little bit of healthy caffeine. Uh, most people are not aware of the fact that oftentimes a lot of uh, coffees contain mold and pesticide. So if you are going to drink coffee, make sure that you know it is a clean, organic, um, certified, third-party verified, pesticide-free and mold-free blend. Um, and the next thing that I like to get into is I actually sit down and, and I read scripture out loud. And through sitting down and reading scripture out loud, I believe that it helps to wake up my spirit, wake up my soul, and to also program my mind and my body with the, the ancient code of the language that is in scripture. So then after I do scripture, um, I do a little gratitude journal where I sit and I write down anywhere from 10 to 20 things that I am grateful for. This helps to keep me in a positive mindset to fight off any um, uh, depression or any, anything that I'm try that's trying to overtake me and just get me in a grateful mood for the day so I can really appreciate all of the wonderful gifts that I've been given in my life and the abilities that I have to go and shine light into other people's lives. So then after my gratitude journal, I usually go ahead and get up, do a little bit of stretching, and then I get outside and get some exercise. I usually like to go do a two or three mile walk uh, while I enjoy a, a second cup of coffee usually, and just wake my system up, wake my body up, get my mind going, get my mind alert, and get the blood pumping. So then after I complete my morning walk and I come back to the house, I usually like to get a big glass of water to drink down. Uh, and then I follow that with some Wim Hof exercise. So if you're not familiar with the Wim Hof method, it is holotropic breathing where you take deep breaths in, diaphragmic breathing and breathe out for about 25 to 30 repetitions. And then on the last breath out, we hold our breath for a minute or two. And I usually do three or four rounds of this and this really supercharges me. It hyper oxygenates my body, helps me to really get fully awake and aware. Um, the next thing that I like to do is then step into a nice cold shower take a cold shower for two minutes to just supercharge my immune system and finish waking me up, getting me charged up for the day. And then once I'm out of the shower, I make sure I throw on some good music, some good tunes to listen to. Um, I actually start my music usually right as soon as I wake up out of bed. And I use music to help increase my mental state and get me into a place where I'm charged up full of energy and on fire and ready to get my day going. Right, so once I'm out of the shower, I'm listening to some music, I usually dance around a little bit, smile real big, and just make sure that I'm fully awake and aware and tuned in for my life. And then I take about five minutes, 10 minutes, and I actually, I write out my entire day in the HPX planner, which is the High Performance Experience Planner. Uh, this is a cool tool that I picked up in the last year and a half or so, and I do my best to follow it on a daily basis and plan out. It's got some cool little journal questions to start the day as well as some journal questions to fill out at the end of the day. And then it also has our top three priorities. So I, I select what my top three priorities are. One of them always involves some form of exercise because I make sure I'm building my daily habits every day in exercise. And then I write out my day, I schedule it out by the hour, and then I take a few moments to just close my eyes and meditate and mentally visualize myself actually doing those things. Um, doing each activity throughout the day. So then after that, I'm all charged up for the day. I'm ready to rock and roll and get after my work. I've got the plan in place to prioritize and execute, and I get after my day. So I hope this is helpful for you. If you do not have a morning routine, well, guess what? You actually do have a morning routine. You're just not aware of it yet. So take some time today and this week to get clarity on what it is that you're doing when you first wake up out of bed in the morning. And then put some specific intent and structure into your life and build some daily habits that you can start practicing on a daily basis so that you can get yourself woken up and get yourself fully engaged and ready to deliver your best self, be your best self for the day. So if you found this, con if you found this video helpful and this content helpful, hit the like button, 
Uh, I look forward to seeing some comments. You guys can leave me some comments about what your daily habits are, what your morning routines are. And if you haven't already, be sure and subscribe. So have a great day, get to work, and I'll see you at the top.